in the heart of the Indian Ocean, a mystery unfolds. The North Sentinel Island, nestled amid turquoise waters, this lush green island is a world away from our bustling cities and digital screens. But it's not just the pristine beauty of this place that captures our fascination, it's the inhabitants, the Sentinelese. A tribe that has successfully resisted contact with the outside world for thousands of years, the Sentinelese are a living enigma. Their existence is a testament to the endurance of human civilization even in its most primitive form. Imagine a world untouched by modern technology, a culture preserved in its purest form, and a society that has thrived in isolation. This is the world of the Sentinelese. They are believed to be one of the last pre-Neolithic tribes in the world. They live as hunter-gatherers, with their lives intricately intertwined with the land and the sea. The Sentinelese are a fascinating paradox. While the rest of humanity has been racing towards technological advancements, they have remained steadfast in their traditional ways. Their survival skills, honed over millennia, have sustained them on this isolated island. Their way of life, though starkly different from ours, is a powerful reminder of our diverse human heritage. But the Sentinelese are more than just an anthropological curiosity. They are guardians of an ancient way of life, living proof of human resilience and adaptability. Their story raises profound questions about civilization, progress, and the true meaning of human development. Yet despite our curiosity, the Sentinelese remain elusive. They have fiercely resisted any attempts at contact, throwing a veil of mystery over their way of life. Their hostility towards outsiders is a clear message. They wish to be left alone. Respecting their wishes is not just about ethical considerations, it's also about protecting them from the dangers of the outside world especially diseases to which they have no immunity. A secret society, untouched by time and modern civilization, the Sentinelese. They are a reminder of our roots, a window into our past, and possibly a mirror reflecting our future. While the world around them advances at breakneck speed, the Sentinelese remain untouched, living like ancient ancestors. In the heart of the Indian Ocean, on the isolated North Sentinel Island, their existence is a living testament to the resilience of humanity. The Sentinelese have adapted to their environment with remarkable survival skills. They are believed to be hunter-gatherers living off the land and sea, relying on primitive tools and their intimate knowledge of the island's resources. They fish in the turquoise waters surrounding the island, hunt in the dense foliage, and gather fruits and roots. Their language, like their lifestyle, is unique to them. It does not match any known language families, creating a linguistic enigma that adds to their mystique. Their social structure, though little understood, is believed to be egalitarian, with no apparent hierarchies. In stark contrast, the rest of the world is a maelstrom of technology and urbanization. Cities teem with skyscrapers that scrape the sky, vehicles that zip along multi-lane highways, and gadgets that connect people across continents in the blink of an eye. While we grapple with the complexities of the digital age, the Sentinelese thrive in their simplicity. They have no electricity, no internet, no modern medicine, and yet they have survived, possibly for tens of thousands of years, in harmony with their environment. This stark contrast between the Sentinelese and the modern world is not just about technology, but also about pace. The world outside rushes, constantly chasing time. While the Sentinelese live in rhythm with nature, their lives dictated by the rising and setting sun, the changing seasons, and the ebb and flow of the tides. It's a humbling reminder that despite our technological advances, we are, at our core, products of nature shaped by our environment. The Sentinelese, with their simple, sustainable lifestyle, provide a glimpse into our past, a mirror to our primal roots. A testament to the enduring strength of human survival, the Sentinelese stand against the tides of time. They are a living relic, a testament to the enduring strength and adaptability of humanity, a beacon of resilience, standing resolute against the relentless march of time. Hostile to outsiders, the Sentinelese are the unseen guardians of their ancient way of life. From the moment of their discovery, these elusive individuals have made it abundantly clear that they have no desire to interact with the outside world. Their hostility towards intruders is not an act of aggression, but a steadfast defense of their way of life, a cocoon they've spun around themselves for over 50,000 years. 
Across the centuries, numerous attempts have been made to penetrate this veil of isolation. From explorers to missionaries, many have tried and failed to establish contact with the Sentinelese. Each attempt has been met with a barrage of arrows, a clear and unequivocal message to outsiders. Stay away. But why such hostility? Why such an unwavering desire for isolation? The answer lies in the very fabric of their existence. The Sentinelese have thrived in their isolation, developing a unique culture and way of life that is inextricably tied to the land they inhabit. They are an unbroken link to our ancient past, a living testament to human resilience and adaptability. Their rejection of the modern world is not born out of fear or ignorance, but out of a profound understanding of who they are and where they come from. They have witnessed the encroachment of modernity on their doorstep, the unrelenting march of progress, and they have chosen to remain steadfast, to protect their way of life at all costs. The Sentinelese are more than just inhabitants of North Sentinel Island. They are its custodians, its unseen guardians. They hold the keys to a past that is rapidly fading from our collective memory, a past that holds invaluable lessons for our future. Their fierce independence, a beacon of resistance against the encroaching modern world, reminds us that there are still places on this earth that refuse to be tamed, that resist the homogenizing forces of globalization. Their existence challenges our notions of progress and forces us to question our relentless pursuit of civilization. The Sentinelese, in their isolation, offer a mirror to our own society, a reflection of what we've lost in our quest for advancement. As we peer into their world from the outside, we're forced to confront our own assumptions about what it means to be civilized. Their fierce independence, a beacon of resistance against the encroaching modern world, the Sentinelese's isolation raises profound ethical questions that challenge our notions of progress and civilization. As we delve into the enigma of the Sentinelese, we are confronted with a colossal ethical dilemma, to reach out or to refrain. On one hand, the allure of unraveling a civilization untouched by modernity is incredibly enticing. The opportunity to learn about their language, culture and way of life is a tantalizing prospect for anthropologists and historians alike. Yet on the other hand, we must grapple with the potential repercussions of such an endeavor. Consider the risks of disease transmission, for instance. The Sentinelese, having been isolated for thousands of years, likely have little to no immunity to modern diseases. Even the common flu could potentially wreak havoc on their population. Furthermore, there's the matter of respecting their sovereignty and their apparent choice to remain isolated. Indigenous rights activists argue that the Sentinelese have a right to their way of life, just as we do to ours. Forcing contact, they say, could lead to cultural erasure and the loss of a unique human heritage. An anthropologist weighs in, it's a balancing act. As much as we yearn to learn more about the Sentinelese, we must respect their decision to remain isolated. We cannot risk causing harm in the pursuit of knowledge. At the heart of this ethical conundrum is a timeless struggle. The tension between preserving tradition and embracing change. As the world around us evolves at a breakneck pace, the Sentinelese stand as a stark reminder of our own past, a living testament to a time when life was simpler and perhaps more connected to the natural world. So where do we draw the line? How do we balance our curiosity with our responsibility to do no harm? These are questions with no easy answers, but they are crucial to consider as we continue to explore our world and its myriad of mysteries. The Sentinelese, a mirror reflecting our own struggle between preserving tradition and embracing change. Untouched by modern hands, North Sentinel Island offers a tantalizing glimpse into a world frozen in time. This secluded island, lost amidst the vast expanse of the Indian Ocean, is a living testament to a way of life that has endured for thousands of years. It's a place where the relentless march of time seems to have paused, allowing nature and tradition to reign supreme. A thick canopy of vibrant greenery blankets the island, providing a protective veil for its inhabitants. The Sentinelese, as we've come to call them, have called this island home for over 50,000 years. Theirs is a life intertwined with the rhythm of the earth, the ebb and flow of the tides, the changing of the seasons. Although the island's verdant forests and pristine beaches may paint an idyllic picture, life here is not without its challenges. The Sentinelese are believed to be hunter-gatherers, 
relying on their intimate knowledge of the land and sea to survive. They master the art of crafting tools from the resources around them, creating everything from fishing nets to simple shelters. The Sentinelese's interaction with their environment is a testament to their resilience and adaptability. They've survived and thrived in a world devoid of modern conveniences, relying solely on their skills, knowledge, and the bounty of nature. Yet, despite the isolation, the Sentinelese are not a relic of the past. They are a living, breathing community with their own unique culture and traditions. Their story is a powerful reminder of the diverse tapestry of human existence and the indomitable spirit of survival. A world apart, yet a part of us, the Sentinelese continue to intrigue and inspire. Their existence challenges our modern perspectives, prompting us to question our own relationship with nature and our understanding of progress and civilization. The North Sentinel Island, shrouded in mystery and cloaked in lush greenery, remains a tantalizing enigma. It's a glimpse into the unknown, a window into a world that has stood the test of time. A world apart, yet a part of us, the Sentinelese continue to intrigue and inspire. As we delve into the mystery of the Sentinelese, we invite you on this journey of discovery. This intriguing tale of a tribe untouched by time is just the tip of the iceberg. There are countless stories and mysteries waiting to be uncovered and we want to explore them with you. Remember to like this video if you found it interesting. It helps us to understand what piques your curiosity. Share this video with friends and family who love a good mystery. Their perspective may offer a fresh take on the subject. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell. This way, you won't miss out on our upcoming explorations. We value your thoughts and insights, so feel free to start a conversation in the comment section. Join us as we unravel more of the world's hidden wonders. Until then, let the Sentinelese inspire you to find your own path, untouched by time.